Okay, time for another quickie. So we got hold on on the relationships for a minute. It's the time for you. Date you. Okay, so you need to hold off on hopping into anything serious right now. It's a time for you to date you, love up on you. It's a time for something new. So you could be used to being in relationships a lot. But it's time for something new. It's a time for you. Date yourself, love on yourself, see what you like. You know what I'm saying? Get in touch with you. Get in touch with the most high. You can't go wrong. Uh, we have cock blocking here, so... Somebody could be uh, currently trying to cock block you, block you at the moment, uh, but you like, okay, kiss my ass, okay, to the haters. You blowing kisses, okay? And then you see she got that butterfly ring going, so you know it's a time for something new. Really time for a transformation for real. And don't let nobody cock block you from this, okay? Then we have here, don't waste your time. So yeah, don't waste your time, okay? Uh, your time is very precious. Don't waste your time on things that um you know you know you don't need at the current moment here it says moving out so somebody could be <laughs> excuse me yeah somebody could be currently moving out or leaving the situation here we have fishing for comments okay so somebody could be uh being that uh somebody may be moving out it may end up on social media somebody could be fishing for comments on the situation or whatever the case may be uh, but it's showing here, it says just leave, it's not working out, okay, so yeah, it's a time for you to, um, it's a time for you all to separate, okay, and focus on yourself, loving yourself, and, you know, dating yourself, and, you know, it's a time for something new, something new, something fresh, okay, uh, we have here, nothing is mine, I have only nothing, but it is enough. It's beautiful and it's all mine, okay? And that is by Catherine Ann Porter, an American author here. Um, yeah, so nothing is yours, okay? So even if you did have, you know, a relationship with someone, you know that you don't own anyone, okay? Uh, we don't own anybody. We own nothing, okay? Uh, for real, for real. You you really don't. If you really just sit down, take your ego out of everything and really sit and think, you don't own nothing. Okay? But that's okay because your nothing is enough and it is beautiful. Okay? And if you also are worried about moving out or splitting up because you feel like you will have nothing, don't worry about that. Because with nothing, you have everything. You have you. That's what you need to find out is more important here. Okay, so a divorce or a breakup is on the verge here. There could be some proof. Somebody could be screenshotting things. Okay, like I said, something could end up on social media here. Um, yeah, something could end up on social media here. But don't let that influence your decisions here. It says here he's depressed, keeping it to himself. So somebody could be feeling real down at the moment. You know, relationships not working out. Uh, you know, that's always a hard time where, you know what I'm saying? You have to split it with somebody because it's not working out. And it could be something that you want it to work. Uh, but it's just not, you know, it's just not working. And it's just not in the cards for you all at the moment here. So... Uh, you may feel depressed, but just know you'll get through it. If you are feeling depressed because of something like this, uh, I would advise you to pray to Yahweh and help and ask uh, for Yahweh to help you see it through. Okay, because, uh, you know, everything will be okay. Uh, a lot of times people don't like changes and things of that nature. But sometimes, again, like that change with that butterfly ring, changes was best for you. OK, and you have to do what's best for you, even if it breaks your heart and leave you sad and depressed for a moment. You have to do what's best for you. It's a time for you and a time for you to date you. It's a time for something new for you. And then we have here, pull three to five oracle cards here. So it says love heals. So yeah, loves he love heals situations here. Okay, you can need that self-love from you or that love from Yahweh so that you can, um, you know, be better here. It says here, gossip here and unbothered, okay? So people could be gossiping about this at the current moment, okay? But you're currently unbothered about that. OK, uh, or it could be a gossip about family issues. OK, if you was in this relationship, OK, you could there's oh, yeah, the I don't know if you heard the horn hunk, but yeah, it could be gossip about your y'all family situation or your family unit, especially if y'all had a family together, 
together if this is a breakup or a divorce here okay we got bad girl nicknamed you trouble okay so it could be you could you could have been dating a bad girl or it could have been um somebody could have been bad in this situation it was cock blocking um love can heal can heal with a um uh, with a bad girl or this person could have just been troubled to you okay and caused you to have family issues and things of that nature here i did pull a love oracle too it says trust transformation of, oh, listen, i wouldn't even pay attention <laughs> Okay, hold on. Okay, trust. Transformation occurs through acceptance. Once you accept the current situation, it'll automatically transform. Like, okay? So, transformation is not bad. You have to accept things for what they are. You and your partner at the current moment, you have to accept things as they are. Uh, even if you all are, you all may not be meant to be together. And y'all need to accept that or y'all need to accept where you all are at at the moment and you may have to break up or separate and it needs to be a time for you needs to be time for something new you all may have to grow separately you never know you never know if you can come back you know what i'm saying so just trust okay just trust in this transformation trust in this newness here and then we have uh y'all know i gotta end it off with a, a grateful heart message here it says here the faithful love of yahweh never ends his mercies never cease okay so uh okay you are loved you're loved by the most high and this is in oh yeah okay so yeah uh, you're given the opportunity to split up and, and and transform here on your own know that this is him giving you mercy and grace you know it never sees here okay um because y'all could have just stayed in the situation and, 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 it's, and then you know it wasn't working and then you all looking like this constantly you know what i'm saying so that's grace and mercy you know what i'm saying for the most high no matter you know try to look at it uh, you know try to look at it different um yeah i'm gonna post the signs the music they may resonate in the places um the initials in the months too as well i have already pulled them uh, i'm just gonna uh, put those on the video here uh, again, thank you all for listening. I hope you heard something that will help you along your journey. It could be something that you're currently going through at the moment. Again, I love you. Y'all loves you. Blessings to you all. And I'll see you all later. Peace.